it's you. Oh. Yes, I heard that you like to murder toys. I have therefore murdered your stupid opening theme as punishment. But we need that! That's too bad. I think next I might actually murder you. Perhaps a fireball, baseball bat, or a potato cannon. <laughs> I may not be there, but I have an agent who is. She's someone who hates you even more than I do. It's almost a done by the same composer as our last theme, uh, DJ KTF, DJKTF.com, and he made that just for us. It's our own little intro. You may recognize him as a crazy looking guy with a chainsaw. Yeah. He also, uh, the latest episode we did with the, um, the snowblower snow potato cannon combination, which was awesome. <laughs> Uh, he's the guy you see running out of the snowblower, because he didn't want to be there when we shot at <laughs> uh, So this is our 10th panel at Anime Boston. Yeah. I'm, I'm Patrick D. And uh, Liz and I did the first panel back in 2003. I remember we walked down to the room and we were thinking, I wonder if anybody will be there. Because, you know, I, we started the convention and we thought, well, we need panel content. Let's do one on our website. You know, a few people have heard of it. And uh, then we got there and there were about how many? Uh, I don't know, uh, 75? We, we packed, filled the yeah. room. There it's was a standing room only. A tiny little park plaza room and it was filled. And we were like, oh, <laughs> too bad we only have this lame experiment to do. <laughs> Embarrassing. We were not quite prepared, but we're going to more than make up for that today. Yeah. Now here's here, here's Chibi Moon. This is the subject of the 2003 test, and that's the last test we did on her. Yes. And uh, but she's pretty well gone, so we moved on to other things. We did Burning Gundam at that point, but now it's just open season okay. on everything. <laughs> um, and so, uh, yeah, we can get right into the next experiment. Our, 49th experiment. 49. 49. 49. So, uh, you may remember 2005, uh, Liz was on the panel, we had Mega Man and the Blender. Didn't go so well. That no. blender was not a good blender. It, it was a smoothie, it was the cheapest blender Target had. <laughs> I think that's the problem. Yeah. Well, it, it's been a cheap ass, too. Yeah. And, well, it also, I think we started to spill smoke. Yes. It was definitely making odd noises. The blender actually started blowing smoke uh, and broke, and Mega Man came out victorious, which is yeah. the only time that's ever happened to us. Well, we the first rich. time. Yeah. <laughs> There's been a couple. Uh, well, you remember 2009 or 10? You would know because. I wasn't here. That was no, it was the one you were at with Matt. 10. 2009. 9. 2009. With the purple hair. 
Garrett. Yes. Two then thousand nine. We, we brought in another blender and we took on a Kenoki, a stuffed Kenoki. Really cute. Really oh, yes. cute. Not gonna save you. Um, that one went all right. We really had to push him in there. We made the mistake of adding water, and it just got gross. <laughs> and it spilled all over. We had to. I had one of those um, the clothes pangers with the snippies for hanging your pants. We had him hanging by his ears in our room, <laughs> like housekeep. <laughs> and uh, so, it's kind of been a long-standing tradition of blenders in Anime Boston and things not going well. Yeah, but it's time to do it right. Now, I will ask people: when you think of a blending. blender, what is the best kind? Guess what we have. Will it blend? God, I hope so. It has a lot to say. It has a lot to say. So, uh, I did a little research. Look what and we did for you. And uh, I, we're going to be successful this time. I know it. I don't, I don't want my phone in there. They've already done a phone. <laughs> donation that was actually in the mail so many uh, a couple weeks ago, and you, you can see us opening it on the next episode of Anime Cons TV, but it will end here. You open it. Oh my god, peanuts! Don't do that! You have a fan. Oh, there's a letter in here. Dear Sketch, it has recently come to my attention that you don't have an actual Misty figure. Your problems are over. Treat her well. I hear there may be condoms watching. <laughs> it's all yours, dude. Treat her well. <laughs> Damn you, movie phone guy. Misty. So, play Misty for me. And, uh... I can open it? I'll get this ready. Thanks, Badger. Oh, God. She comes with some kind of... What is this? What is this? Oh, it's a horsey. It's like a, like a sexual. She's like doing trains. That is what it looks like. She is walking like an Egyptian. Get in here. I didn't put on her backpack here. Get in here. Now, I will say, as Blendtec tells you on their podcast thing, YouTube channel, don't try this at home. <laughs> also, these blenders aren't cheap. No. no. So if you look at if you look at eBay in the next few weeks and see a blender that's been used once, <laughs> just saying. No one saw it happen.
can't see the menu on the front of this. So. I'm just hitting pulse and I'm holding it down because I can't see the menu, so whatever. I probably should have read the manual. No, I felt the piece come out. Oh, alright. The, the top is not airtight. There's things and it's coming through. There's all this misty dust. <laughs> All right, that ought to hold it. Yeah. It'd be a terrible way to die down the Now, when you think about it, how long are those Will It Blend videos? They're like 30 seconds or something? How long have I been doing this? Big shot. Uh, lighter weight than most of the things they attempt to murder. Right? Yeah, but still, she did jump around. Instead of like smashing around, she just like bounced around. She hit it. Is it also hot? Hot. 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 Gone. And also, I don't know if you can tell, this is plastic, not glass. So I've had this constant fear that there would be this piece coming through. And I think of, like, they put an iPhone in there and that has metal parts. Oh my god! So. Also, I hope this cleans off so I can resell it. You know what it looks like? It looks like sprinkles that go on top of yogurt. <laughs> sprinkles! Well, you can't have the head. Her, her head's gone. All I have is her hair. Her face. Her face. Her face. Her face. Her face. <laughs> We have a new camera here. This is the uh, the I don't know. GoPro. Yeah, the GoPro. Oh, he's got one on his head. Yeah, see. But yeah, we're using this for close-ups now. Hello. So, yeah, that, that's an awesome experiment. I think we finally licked the blender experiment. Yeah, we can put the blender to bed, I think. So, I'll, the only one we have failed that we still have is the hair, curling iron. Oh my it's god. It's like I kind of did nothing. Nothing. I don't know if it was the hair or the curling no, iron. No, it was the curling iron. I, I, think, I think we try a soldering iron. So, and uh, for the people watching on the podcast, you can email us at podcast at tvproject.com, call our voicemail line, say where you are, or who you are, where you're calling from, uh, 762-ADEQUATE, that's 762-233-7828. You, you guys can even call from here, like after you leave, and leave a voicemail, it would be awesome, we'll put it in the episode. And uh, subscribe to us on iTunes, just search for Chibi Project, we've got tons of episodes there, like 33, so the complete history, that's just a taste that we had on the screen. He wants to resell the blender. I don't think anyone wants it. It's Probably. a very expensive blender. <laughs> I kind of want my money back. Because I have no need for a restaurant Are you level going to blender. Advertise it as a TV project blender? I don't know if that would help or hurt. It, I think it depends if I can clean this or not. If I can clean it, I think I'm safe. If I can't clean it, I think I have to explain why it's marred with all these. Different colored smudges. smudges. <laughs>
I'm on a really weird diet, all right? Yeah. Uh, I, I put only plastic. I put cake in there, and it was really old cake. It's all funfetti, that's all it is. Patrick, if I get that as a wedding gift later this year, I'll be very, very Wedding angry. gift. <laughs> <laughs> don't pass it off on me. You, you don't, you, your Blendtec blender's not in your list? It should be. Yeah, anymore. Sure, that was pretty good. That was a collector's side. I do wish I'd made, like, a, a milkshake out of this first, but <laughs> too late for that. Uh, like a couple hundred. What? Yeah, this they sell new for like between four and five hundred dollars. Yeah. Uh, you can find them on eBay cheaper. So. Oh, you okay? Is that a It's like chicken. This is Misty's backpack. I was curious so chewy it was. You've been taking on traits of your dogs. <laughs> yes. Actually, uh, one of my dogs ate an entire washcloth recently. Uh, had to have surgery to have it removed. And, uh, I, am, I am now aware of her incredible capacity to eat things that are not food. So uh, I actually plan to use her in a future experiment in a safe way um, to... Uh, Really? Let's just say annihilate a little. I get you a nice stuff. red lens. Because actually, people have been asking to feed it to a dog, and I was like, oh, this well, is cool. We can, we can definitely arrange to have it uh, destroyed by a dog, although I will not be paying for surgery again. I'm not either. There will not be any injection. Especially if they can't sell this blender. There will be no animal cruelty on the TV. Yes. But uh, I am willing to let her salt an item. All right. Hi everyone, sorry for the delay in posting this episode, but there was so much in it, I wanted to get it right. Plus, I'm selling the Blendtec Blender. I wanted to put this at the end to let you all know that on December 1st, you'll be able to find it on eBay. And you'll see it hasn't been cleaned. It still even has misty bits in it. And uh, it's got all the scrapes and bruises. Uh, the blender still works great, but if you buy it, I will give it, I'll uh, include the box it came in. It says demo machine. Let's assume this says demolition machine. Also comes with this handy recipe book. If you want to actually use it for food. And uh, as a special bonus, and I'm getting pieces all over the table still. Special bonus, I'll include the pieces of Misty. You can actually have the Misty we destroyed with this blender. So look for this on eBay on December 1st, 2012. Uh, you can find a link from our Twitter account, that is at Chibi Project, or we'll post it on our Facebook page. Or just search eBay for Chibi Project Blender, and you should be able to find it. So, uh, happy bidding!